Our next option is to click our display option window or button. As I click that button, again I get a control box and we have a lot of different information on here. Starting over at the left hand side, we notice that these are the panels that we're going to view from our training screen. We see raw waveform, filter waveform, we have check thermometers, and the Brain Mirror FFT. I'm going to actually turn the Brain Mirror FFT off. I can always add this. Any of these panels can come on and off live from the training screen. As I go up to the top on this side, I see tech stats live and component trend graphs. I'm going to actually also turn off my tech stats. Going slightly to the right, we'll also see under frequency bands, these are actually which components will we show. As we zoom in, we notice that theta is checked, beta is checked, and high beta is checked. These are actually which bands are going to show up in the panels. Now even though we were ignoring alpha for instance, I could check alpha and I can be watching its progress and what's happening as we're training the other bands or I can leave it off. Okay. After I've made these decisions, I simply scroll down and I click the OK and that will save the decisions.